do subscribe to ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos interspecific hybridization now if i say interspecific it means particular and when i say hybridization it means mating of two different species so students let's study and find out that how interspecific hybridization is different from outbreeding outcrossing etc okay interspecific hybridization now what happens in interspecific hybridization is that a superior male or a male that has great qualities in terms of productivity in terms of milk production is used also a female which is superior in that particular breed is used now this male and female having superior qualities are used how does the process of interspecific hybridization starts what is done is semen is connected or semen is collected from the male counterpart and this semen is always collected from the superior male the reason why it has to be collected because if i talk about a superior male this superior male will have greater milk abilities it will produce a greater quality of meat in case of poultry animals once semen is collected what's done is that this semen or the male sperm is injected into the female counterpart and once that, that is done the female is allowed to breed now this female which is having sperm of the male counterpart which had great qualities will produce you simply say progeny daughter or children which ha will have greater or best of the qualities now during this process what's done is that the mating process when animals are selected as males or of females they need to be belong to two different species interspecific breeding now if you break that word interspecific interspecific means something which is greater at a particular organism quality and hybridization is nothing but breeding so what happens during interspecific breeding is that the male breed or you simply say the male cattle as well as the female breed or the female cattle are selected now during this selection what happens is that they have to be two different species entirely different species what happens during the process is that semen or the male gamete is collected from the superior male and this semen collected from the superior male or the male counterpart is further injected into the female reproductive tract obviously the process of reproduction will take place after 7 to 8 months approximately and once that happens the progeny or you say child will have the desirable traits of both mother and father
Now what happens in in the specific hybridization is that control breeding or breeding with only certain desirable characteristics is done. For this, what is used is artificial insemination. Now when I say artificial insemination, it simply means that semen or you say it reproductive gamete or reproductive sperm from the male is used and it is put it into the ovary of the female tract. Now what's that done? The problem that happens is that the normal mating process is better or it efficiency increases. Also a process that's called MOED which is multiple ovulation embryo transfer. Now what's done is your cow is taken. Cow is injected with a hormone which is FSH, follicle stimulating hormone. Now this hormone what it does is it induces follicular cells of the ovaries and which further produces eggs. So students in this part of the chapter what we came across was interspecific hybridization and how interspecific hybridization has had great impact on the production of cattle, increasing their productivity etc. So I hope you are very clear with this concept. Thank you.